Hey guys, how you doing? Dave here. Um, if I haven't responded to your comments, it's because I cut my hand pretty deep and it's hard to type, but I'll get around to it and sorry about that. But today we're making up this super delicious takeout dish. Well, actually it's better than takeout. Pepper steak, incredibly delicious. The steak is so tender, served over a bed of rice, the veggies, and the great thing is you can do it in 30 minutes. You're gonna love this. So let me walk you through it. Okay guys, so the first step, we're going to add three quarters of a cup of water, and this is going to be our sauce. Three tablespoons of soy sauce, and this is going to be your sodium, so you don't need salt. Two tablespoons of sugar, a couple of tablespoons of cornstarch, and this will just thicken things up. And of course, you can't have pepper beef without pepper, so... I'm going to add a fair amount here and a few drops of sesame oil. I'm just going to kind of eyeball this. You don't want a whole lot, but you don't want too little. Ding, like a church bell. Then I'm just going to take my whisk and mix things up, just like I am. And I forgot about a tablespoon of oyster sauce, just for some additional flavor. And that's our sauce. Next up, I've got some sirloin here, and I'm just going to go ahead and flatten this up a little bit just to tenderize it. So we're just going to go ahead and cut this in fairly fine strips across the grain, because if you don't do it across the grain, it gets fairly tough, and you want a good sharp knife. Now I've got this sliced up, I'm going to add some more pepper to it because after all it is pepper beef. Now I'm going to give this a little stir just to make sure everything is well combined and maybe just a tad more pepper. Okay next up I'm going to add some oil to a preheated pan over medium high heat. Add the beef in, and we're just going to fry this until it's brown. Now the beef is brown, I'm going to add in a small onion, three cloves of garlic, a thumb-sized ginger, a green bell pepper, and some carrots. And you could add some red bell pepper too if you like. And we're just going to fry this up until it's tender crisp. And you want the green peppers to change color a little bit. And that wonderful aroma of garlic fills the air. And of course, ginger too. After a couple of minutes, it's time to add our super delicious sauce. Oh, this smells so good. So we're just gonna go ahead and bring this to a boil. I'm just gonna give this a stir and let our sauce thicken. Oh, <laughs> so good. After the sauce is thickened, we're just gonna kill the heat and we're good to go. And we're gonna go ahead and serve this up over a bed of steamed rice. And there you have it guys, our pepper steak. Incredibly delicious. Okay, let's go ahead and give this a taste test. Mmm. Guys, this is so good. Beef is tender, the veggie, the spices. Mm. 
And the great thing is, you can do it in 30 minutes. You're going to love this. For the full recipe, head on over to cookandshare.com. All kinds of great stuff there. You're going to love it. So thanks for subbing and thanks for watching and see you next time.